Hey everybody, <clears throat> welcome back to another episode of Phenoma Factory, GTCEU Hard Mode. Okay, I just realized that my map is all weird. And I don't know how to fix that. Uh, there we go. Okay, cool. Um, <clears throat> yeah, so welcome back to Phenoma Factory, we are in episode 80. Last episode we were working on, I believe we made the tier 4.5 minor, and then we were working on the LUV circuit assembler. Uh, which in this case, assembler. There we go. It is all done. So I guess I don't know. Put that for the title, maybe. But we'll do more stuff. So it could change. Okay. So I don't think I did too much off camera between episodes. I really just kind of cleaned up the floor here. Uh, I might need to make another uh, waypoint down here. Uh, or move this. Yeah, you know what? Well, I'll I'll move that later, I guess. Um. <clears throat> uh. Ch 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 oh, I did make the item terminal. So I guess I misunderstood what this what this terminal was for. Much like the fluid terminal, where it tells you what's being put into the slots, like the input output, and not the pattern slots. The item one will tell you what items are being put in. So. Oh. 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 Okay, here we go. So we see like the elite mixer. You have samarium, iron, and arsenic. That's our arsenic samarium mixer, whatever the heck it's called again. So all those dusts, you know, are being sent to that machine. All right. So that's a cool thing to figure out if I. It's the cool thing to use if I need to figure out where all my items are going to, like salt. See, I kind of went ahead and I renamed some of my interfaces, like salt in for hydroxide, salt in for chlorine. Stuff like that. And I don't know why it's on 21. I guess I was lazy. But anyway, so that is neat. So I did kind of go ahead and prepare some tier, tier micro miners here today. I was making a pattern, actually, off camera. I set up the pattern for the soul binder. Now, the soul binder is this little thing, right? It requires mob heads. Also requires a soul machine chassis, which I don't think is going to be too hard. What is the solarium ingot? Okay, that's not different. Soul sand, though. Soul sand. Okay, well, I can do that. But uh, yeah, so I did go ahead and get that set up in an in a <clears throat> interface. I was actually working at making a ore drilling plant off camera. Nothing has been made for this yet. Uh, you see here that we need a IV assembler to make the, the controller. But then there's some other items here. So like the IV fluid regulator, nothing too crazy, just an IV assembler as well. IV conveyor module, that's not a big deal. Stellar pickaxe, right? So that's a one that I haven't, we haven't made yet. And I might actually, I don't know if I want to keep one of these for myself or not, but we'll see. Infinity rod. Oh, okay, well, that's not too crazy. Um, so the reason we need the soul binder is we are going to need to be making sentient ender, right? And enter, wait. Okay, good, good lord. Okay, so we can make a soul witch file. So that's not a big deal. Uh, so the soul binder will take a ender resonator and make the sentient ender. Resonator. Oh, goodness. Okay, we're also going to need to make a slice and splice, which shouldn't be too big a deal. Okay, so the other thing is that we need skulls and heads, right? So the Enderman head, for example, comes from a four and a half micro miner. And with that, we get pearls, shulker shells, and pearls. I don't know if we're going to be needing these too much, but we'll see later on, I assume. The pearls would be nice to have too, but we need the heads. And beyond that, um, the creeper heads are gained with, again, the tier four and a half micro miner, but the tree sapling, erothium, and with that we get skeleton, zombie, creeper, get some slime, get some guardian scales, flesh, and bones. So pretty cool all around. I did go ahead and set up patterns for this. So let's see if I remember how to spell it. I think uh, skull zom creeper, right? Oops. So if I request that, you can see it has all the parts you need to do. Set that off. And then Ender... Oh, what did I call it? 
Uh, let's see, where's my crafting button? Oh, oh here we go. Ender drops. Yeah. Okay, so send that off too. Um, I did do a lot of... Actually, I did do a lot of um, mission sending. It looks like we're out of salt. Must be, it must have been all processed. Um, so first thing we see, you see, we have about 12,000 copper. I sent off quite a bit of those machines, or the microminer missions, and about 1,300 silver. So we should be good there for a while. Okay, so we have the skull, we have the heads. Is that, being, is that even done yet? Okay, it's making the powder. Wait, why is it making the powder? Oh, get rid of that. Do we not... Wait, did it? Um, okay. I think it's done. Ed. Okay. I don't know. Okay, I, I think we have everything, so I'll cancel that now. Okay, so let's see. Binder. We have everything but the chassis. Oh, and the solarium. Wait, ender. Wait, what? Hello? Did this not get sent off? What's uh, okay, let me go check. Oh, wrong action, section. <clears throat> oh, it's still working on it. Why is it still working on it? Oh, okay. All right, I guess that was just a long craft. There we go. Okay, so binder. All right, so now we, all we need the chassis and the solarium plate. So solarium, again, not going to be a big deal, but we are going to have to get an automator or uh, the atomic resonator working on that for the soul sand or rather wither dust now nah. about that okay so uh atomic maybe yeah oh, i will need to put the um soul sand on the white list let's see ivy alloys okay let's see get down here oh it's actually i keep forgetting my my state of mind keeps thinking that the activator is behind me and down below i think that's been a i think that's a carryover from my previous let's play okay soul sand actually no i don't even need, need to craft i'll just grab this and whitelist okay so if i request soul sand make sure i turn on my magnet I request 16. there we go Sweet. Okay. So now we need the chassis. Chassis. And that needs the industrial. We have that. Good, good, good. Oh, wait. All right. There we go. Um, okay. And then we need a macerate, the ingot. Okay. So HB dust, maybe? Hello? And there we go. Okay, so let's see if we can make this. Oh yeah, what's wrong? Oh, the plates. Okay, solarium plate. Bender, bender, bender. Get rid of that. Wait, do we need to put the, I think, quadruple because of our machine? Plates. Oh, God, my throat is uh, a little scratchy from food. Okay, binder. There we go. Mm. Okay, so... That is all cooking up. Now, I don't think... 
XP is going to be as easy to come by in this. However, looks like I'm wrong. We can make it. What would be the easiest thing to make? Villager. Well. What's the grain, grains of the end? Ender crystal, ender man. Hmm. This is going to be a interesting dilemma. So, I mean, we could start off simple with grains of the innocence, probably. How about, <clears throat> I'll probably have to process some of these emeralds. But, let me grab that binder out of there. Damn it. Okay. Nope. Oh, damn it. Ranch, where'd he go? If. <clears throat> okay. So with that, we're gonna need a capacitor. And did I just toss it out of my hand again? Oh, I tossed the interface. Or, uh, okay, there's the binder. Okay, so that capacitor is cooking up. It's done. Cool. We're going to figure out a place to put this. Probably down below, maybe. Could probably put some over here, actually. We've cleared up some room. Might not be a bad idea. Though... It's over here. Nothing. All right, well, eventually I'm going to be doing some automation on this. So I'll be having more of these, right? And, well, we'll get to that when we get there. But for the time being, something like push-pull. That way we can push items in and out of the machine. And in here we put that, okay? So let's get some conduit. <clears throat> That should do fine. And conduit for AE. There you go. Now we know this exists. And for this, we'll put so binder. Okay. So, yeah, now we have the machine ready, but we don't have the experience. So, in that vein, we are going to need to have a Fluid interface, which we'll probably like put here and conduit, 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 conduit. All right. So in that vein, the fluid conduit will extract, insert into there, and in oh, hello, and in here we put experience. I don't have any right now, of course, so we'll be fixing that shortly. Um, for this will put XP for binders. Oh, XP for binders. Okay, so that way we can see it on our system, but I mean, I'm not going to be able to, I'm not going to lose this, but it's still good to have. Oh, let me get my magnet back on. Okay, so where, you where are we on time? 14 minutes. Okay, we got time. So, um, XP, no, uh, Grains of Innocence, I believe it was. Okay, so for this, we're going to need the binder, and we're going to need to put EXP, wait a minute, can we? Okay, I think we have actually have to make, uh, let's, let's see, EXP rod? Yeah. Okay, so we're going to need this. Now, the XP rod is, is how we're going to get our initial experience into the machine. Because it... Wait, did I put that in the right spot? Yeah, okay. Uh, we'll grab that. 
cool so what this rod does is it stores experience oh, let's make it in the environment alloy and that way we can then i think stick it into the machine so whoop. okay should have some experience over here in my furnaces because i had like put some items in here okay so i think i have to go to the machine first Experience rod. Hold on, what? Right click on a fluid tank container. Shift right. Wait a minute. EXP. No, wait. Great. Item great. Um. Do, 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 do. Okay, give me a second. I'm going to figure out how to get my experience out of me. Okay, well, I guess <clears throat> I kind of forgot about this, but uh, the experience rod is also used to make the experience obelisk. And this is a good way to get fluid in and out of a machine. Let me put that back in there. Obelisk. Okay, so we can make that no problem. Why am I have tuning it? Oh, because I grabbed it from the furnace's derp. Okay, so that is cooking up. We'll get this shortly. Now the reason I'm making, actually I mentioned that, I do want to get the ore drilling machine, that way I can go and find a large vein and drop it down, put some gas turbines on there and get that ore going. The reason why is because if you, if you look at the tool tip here, it produces three times more crushed ore than a macerator. So we'll be getting like, for example, did, 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 macerator. So we'll get six times uh, the crushed versus two for silver, and that would be pretty cool. Okay, so let's go back down here. Now, if I put this here, for example, and now I can store experience in there. Now, this should be able... To, actually, let me double check. That should be able to, oops, to access, but just in case, I'm just going to do push-pull. Okay, so they should communicate to each other, but let's just find out if this will work. Let's go back up to our terminal here, and we need to make the sentient ender. Okay, so we want to make sure that we put that like that. Put, oh, there. Okay, so the render, resonator in the soul vial. All right, so we need to get this. Oh, that's right, still need to slice and splice. Okay. We'll get that first, then... Do I have few quartz? Wait, wait, uh, does this need few quartz? It's gonna go through all the colors here. Okay, well, that's not terrible, I guess. Okay, then, um, let's, oop, let's get, let's get that going, then. So we'll grab a mold. Oh, look at that, we already have one. Nice. Okay. <laughs> okay, so let's go pop that over to the tower position. Do we even have an empty spot? There we go. I right, put that there. And wrench and screwdriver. Okay. And do 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 do. MV used quartz. Okay. Make sure that's on output and back home we go. Okay, so a few quartz. Oh, I really, really hate the metadata. Now there's like a sh crap ton of fused quartz and you're trying to find the one that has a recipe. Okay. And soul vial should be in a wall. And that will stay with us. Stay with us. Okay. Vial. 
Wait, did I forget about the, the recipe for the vial? So vile. Oh, I guess I did forget the recipe with it for the vial. Uh, fuse quartz. Okay, it's already in there, so we don't need to worry about that. And bada boom. Okay, so. Okay, so we can make a vial. Let's go through the cooking first. Sweet. Okay. So, slice and splice. Slice. Okay. I don't think we need to worry about too much about the recipe there, so I'll just go ahead and put that in there. Slice, and we're missing dark steel. Okay. Do we even have dark steel rods? We do. This? Yeah, okay. I have to make sure. Okay. Now, slice. Okay, let's make it. Oh, it means tungsten steel. Maybe I should make a blast furnace for tungsten steel too now. I've already done it for signalium aluminum. Uh, it might be beneficial to have for tungsten steel later on down the road. Mm. Okay, hopefully I can get the drilling going. Now, in order to use the slice and splice, we're going to need uh an axe and shears shears oh i think we can use dark shears but oh god why does shears may have to have a stupid recipe like this the dark shears though i mean that shouldn't be a big deal that should be doable Okay, so we need to have a dark steel shear maker. And that should be fine there. Okay, slice and splice. Okay, there we go. So let's go back down here and we'll put this generally in the same spot. I don't think this needs... No, okay, it doesn't need experience, which is... Good, thankfully. Nope. I think I'm beginning to see some sort of lag in my game, but the uh, the TPS doesn't seem to be affected too much. So I don't know. Okay, so put that there, and we're gonna need. Uh, actually, I can just do this. Okay, and the same can be said probably for the. E2. Okay. And we'll grab a interface. And for here, oops, not that. For here, push pull. All right. Now, put my knife. There, oh, okay. Uh, slice and splice. Now, I think. I should be able to do not that should be able to do this and the dark steel oh there's no axe I should just do a stone axe I think okay so that will go in there nice now the question is am I going to be able to slice and splice a recipe and have that item input so, Resonator, I think that was the item we needed, yes. So, Silicon Wafer, Glowstone. We don't have Nakwa Dug yet, so we can get rid of that. Okay, so we'll do this. Okay, that should be fine. Let's go back down. Put this in there. Um, we need to make the dark steel shears. 
Dark steel. Shears? Dark shears. Okay. And over here. Dark shears. Okay. So over here. Nice. All right. In moment of truth, can we request a resonator? Hey, there we go. Nice. Okay. So that is awesome. So now, if we wanted to, we could put another slice here, another one here, and another one on top there, and that will split the recipe pattern if there are more than one. So if I have, if I ask for, well, this recipe we put in there will do two. So let's say if I ask for four, it will split the load between this one here and like this one up here, for example. So that's pretty sweet in that regard. Okay, so um, the sentient ender goes in the binder. Okay, so the binder goes there. Now, I don't know if we have the experience to cook another one item up. Oh, wait, we do. We didn't use it yet. Okay, so uh, sentient. There we go. I forgot the name of it for a second. There we go. And there we go. It should pop out. There we go. Nice. We did it. Oh, that was the pattern. Okay. So there is our Santiet Ender. Now we can't mute these like we can with the Greg Tech stuff. So I think we should be able to add recent slice. And that should be good. Because we know, just know that when we get to crafting things more often, the sound might get on our nerves as we get close to it. Closer and closer to it. <clears throat> okay, so I needed the stellar pickaxe from all this. Pickaxe. So there's a pattern. There's a pattern. Now we need the infinity rod, which again, no big deal. But there we go. And boom. Uh, dark steel nugget. Oh, geez, I can't believe I don't have that. Come on. Okay. Okay. Oh, it's making that. No, it should be fine. Yeah, we have an, we have <clears throat> we had it in the IV furnace, so it's, it's yeah, it's fine. We're, we're cooking. We're cooking. Okay. Now I think that took care. Oh, there it is right there. I think that took care of everything. That we needed for the plant. No, it didn't. Oh, the pump. What was the pump? Why didn't I have the pump automated? I don't know why, actually. Uh, what did that need again? L LV? Okay. P U M P. I'm sure that's not enough, but we'll see. Oh, okay, that was it. Okay, so if we can make that, then... Shoot, what, did I even make the pattern yet? Or dr no, oil. I don't think I made the pattern yet. Okay, so let's do this. Or drill. Okay, so now we have the... the, the the controller block there. We have the frame box. I think we have this. I think we have that. Uh, input hatch. We want to get... Wires EV power. Do we have a combustion? Hmm. We could get four generators. And that would give us EV power, technically. Yeah, okay, I think we'll do that. Um, we'll request four of those. And for the energy input hatch, 
we're going to need a EV hatch, EV energy. Uh, do, 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 do. Hmm. Okay. Put that there. And the output bus, probably get rid of that. Um, bu 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 output bus. Okay, so we'll grab a cobble here, and I'm running out of time. We'll do EV or drill. Damn it. <clears throat> Just want to get some experience. Uh, that won't do. Uh, okay, be right back. I'm going to do one thing. Hey, everybody. Okay, so I went and got some experience, and I requested the package here. So it is going to be making this old bad boy. It's going to be a while, so probably going to be logging off after this episode. But we have the generators being cooked up. And because we have a good supply of gas now, I can just plug this gas into the system. And we'll be able to get ore drilled from... Uh, in the world. I'm probably going to be doing some drilling off camera and then next episode we'll come back and show it on camera. So, uh, yeah, that is going to be it for now. Um, that was just kind of a side episode to get some fun stuff going. Uh, do, do, do. I've got a lot to do. Um, when I try and get the tier five micro miner, but we had to get into nuclear craft. So probably nuclear craft soon. Anyways, uh, that's going to be it for now. I will see you guys next time. That's all for now.